Hey, it's Ocean. In today's video, I will be playing my Enzoi save with you. There are tons of informative videos out right now by our peers, so I would definitely consider checking them out. But for right now, we're just gonna sit back, relax, and enjoy some Enzoi. Thank you Crafton for allowing me early access to Enzoi. This game is still currently in development and all content is subject to change. Welcome to our little mini series, our Enzoi mini series with my Zoe Annette Washington, who is enjoying some guitar in the morning. <laughs> I'm gonna have her paint a picture. She loves painting. She is an artistic Zoe. Once they paint, it just disappears. It doesn't go into their inventory, AKA their bag. It only increases the art skill, which is very important for her because she is an artistic Zoe. These are her other characteristics based off of this one trait. So all of these are her traits, essentially. She values coexistence, accomplishment, autonomy, and love. I won't read the description, so I don't take up too much of your time, but you can definitely take a look at it. She enjoys artistic and creative activities, frequently feels sad, sentimental feeling lasts for a longer time, and she avoids conversation. Right now she's talking to Louise, her roommate, AKA her future husband, but he doesn't know it yet. <laughs> Proposed to stay together in the future. I'm gonna have her say this to him. I've been trying to build up their relationship slightly. Oh, so after that little conversation, he is feeling touched. Annette Washington, we're good friends. He'll be there when we're needed. Few details. I love that. So Annette just text him. I know that she's living with us. Occasionally your friends and other Zoys that you know will text you and you can respond to some of them. I'm going to reply positively. You always make me laugh. Let's stick together. See, we really get along. I've held on to one good friend. That is so cute. I can't wait until we get the ability to like respond here. Our buddy here, Luis Ramos, is the roommate. Like I said, he's feeling very touched by that sentiment. When Zoys are touched, they can quickly improve their instrument and photography skills and relevant conversations become available. So being touched after hearing the benefits of helping and highly praised. I know you're probably wondering what highly praised is. Well, Zoys have certain desires or needs and recognition is one of them. A need to be acknowledged by other Zoys. If you need recognition, you can just speak to other Zoys. And I'm guessing they just need to have their existence validated almost. That's kind of how I understand it. I love how we're just walking in the house right now. But because he's feeling touched, he can raise this instrument skill. So let's just practice. We have drums. We have drums, isn't that so cool? Get it, Louise. It sounds good already. Let me turn this TV off, actually. This is our cute little home in our tiny little neighborhood in Bliss Bay. The name of the game in Zoe is a compound of N plus Zoe. Zoe comes from the Greek word Zoe, meaning in life or to enjoy life. Players watch the lives of Zoes, changing everything in the world of Enzoi as they wish and creating their own unique stories. I'm controlling my Zoe right now because I actually want to get out the house. I could go somewhere, but I just love that I can just walk with her. But you essentially can control your city. So if you hit M, which is going to bring this up, you see our city of Bliss Bay and our parallel universe. It is your job to take care of your Zoys and manage them, okay? So you do kind of have a goal. Your Zoys have karma. So their life is based off the good and the bad deeds that they do, even when Zoys aren't watching. So if you volunteer, that is good karma. If you litter and throw your trash on the ground, that is bad karma. And as you can see here, this Zoe is starting to get to the slightly bad <laughs> karma. We can intervene if it gets too bad, but we're not. We're just going to let it happen right now. We can't anyway if we wanted to, but we can also see all of the Zoys that live in our world right now. And their names are still in Korean. However, that's just a bug in the game right now. We also have souls. So when your Zoys pass away, then they become a soul. And then we also have Henry, which which is our HR team assistant who gives us some advice. In Zoe, which you will be managing as trainee gods, is filled with various cities and Zoys and managing their lives and karma scores is a primary duty. Proper management of the karma of Zoys is crucial for maintaining the balance between our company and the world. Failing to manage this properly may ne necessitate solving issues through a meeting with the CEO and the CEO is like a mysterious figure in the world. Please feel free to seek advice from me or other colleagues whenever you face difficulties. Lastly, the time between 5 and 6 a.m is special for a Zoe, so please refrain from intervening in a Zoe's life during these hours. You'll find out why later. So it's kind of interesting because you have a system here where you are in control of your city 
and <laughs> you want to maintain it. I mean, it's up to you if you want to change that. You have the city stability. So if I want more romantic relationships, I can increase that. That will affect the pace of romantic relationships, proposal success rate, and the chances of having children. So I'll probably set that pretty high because I'm a family game player <laughs> and I'm setting the family relationships up too high. We can even control city sanitation, which affects the rate at which Zoys and furniture become dirty. I'm going to leave that to medium fire prevention rate yes there are fires and city safety affects the probability of zoys engaging in violent acts and then health level affects the lifespans of zoys and the likelihood of diseases so maybe i could say that there could be a flu or cold going around and i could set that to low and maybe everyone would get sick you'll see they will get sick and dream occurrence rate you can also change that as well you can also change the positive negative emotional control if you increase it then it'll increase positive emotions if you lower it it will increase the negative emotions you get a city report it'll tell you how many car accidents have occurred and how many animals you've interacted with because there will be cats kind of roaming around sometimes. You can adjust the weather. So here it's very sunny. If you want it snowy, you can see we can make it super snowy. This doesn't happen automatically, so there aren't seasons. If I want it to rain, I would actually have to make it rain myself, which I think is pretty cool to still have this feature. And there also aren't any effects to the rain as far as gameplay is concerned. I mean, her clothes did get wet, as you can see here, but there isn't an option to dance in the rain or something like that. I haven't noticed that yet, but it's raining and it looks horrible, so I'm going to actually make it sunny again. Look how the, the screen on the iPad looks all wet and mucky. I love the little details in Enzoi, I must say. They're so good. Now it's sunny again. And I won't spend too much time here, but you can edit the signs that you see, so the billboards. Look at this, Sally, will you marry me? <laughs> you can add your own also, which is pretty cool. And then you can also add at the trees if you'd like, because again, this is your city. So you go for it, you do what you want. If I want it to be fall, I guess I could make it look like fall. I'm just gonna leave the trees the same. And you can also adjust the color because there's a color wheel for everything. <laughs> And then you can also adjust your grass as well, the grass around the city. It's so cool how you can do this, right? You can customize so much. I'll probably leave this the same because I think that's really cute. You can add some decorations. So if I want some little cats here, I probably won't do this. <laughs> and you can also add animals. Like I could add more cats, which I think I'm gonna do. I'm gonna add a ton of cats. And you could also add like foxes and things like that around the world. But I'm gonna, you see the foxes, oh my goodness. <laughs> and you can add crocodiles if that's your thing too. There are also special effects. You can have fireworks. You can see this better at nighttime actually. But the environment here, it's so cool how you can literally make a zombie apocalyptic looking world and a beautiful world. Obviously we're gonna leave it a beautiful world. So we're walking now. She's feeling sentimental. When Zoys are sentimental, they can quickly improve their instrument. And for Oh, okay, that's the same as feeling touched almost. Feeling very sentimental and then also a little bit focused too. Oh, because of the rainy weather. Enjoys rainy weather from artistic trait. That is precious. I love that. She actually enjoys the rainy weather. <laughs> So I kind of don't feel like walking. I want a car like everyone else. I'm going to have Luis buy a car because there's no way he's going to walk around like our beautiful Annette is doing. I think we're going to get an SUV. I kind of want an SUV or convertible. Let's get an SUV. I'm kind of feeling that. Our game just auto-saved. Shout out to Enzoi for auto-save feature. <laughs> Hope Sharing Foundation. Oh, wait, we just got... A text. The Hope Sharing Foundation just messaged us. It says Children's Education Volunteer Initiative participate as an educational volunteer in our project supporting children from low income families. Your knowledge and experience can help these children aspire to a brighter future. We invite those interested in educational volunteering to join us. The schedule is ill. 8, 8 a.m. tomorrow. I definitely want to volunteer. And let me remove this. <laughs> I definitely want to volunteer. I want to volunteer. We appreciate your registration. Please come to the front of the Hope Sharing Building at 8 a.m. tomorrow. And that was from Hope Sharing Foundation. So we will get a prompt on our schedule. We do have a schedule, or I could say a calendar almost. So this is actually still in development, so I can't add a schedule, unfortunately. But you can see here it says Social Welfare Foundation. I cannot wait to attend this tomorrow. Luis being presented with this opportunity makes so much sense because of his traits. 
He has the volunteer trait, so he's kind and generous, big-hearted, sociable, altruistic, self-sacrificing, and responsible. And his values are coexistence, rule-abiding, love, and traditionalist. He frequently engages in helping others, frequently feels sentimental, confidence feel, feeling lasts for a shorter time, and recognition gauge decreases slowly. And he also enjoys conversation. He's my big teddy bear. And in his values right now, which are the direction of the life one pursues, right now he values coexistence the most. When any value exceeds 60 points then that's when your value specific interactions and conversations are added so when i interact with annette we will see this but let me go ahead and ooh, bliss bay beach volleyball court is actually having something going on too we can travel there but i want to get a car i don't want to lose focus on that i'm gonna do my dream car and make it a white suv i would never get a white suv because i don't think i would be able to keep up cleaning it <laughs> So now that we have a car, I know you're probably thinking, this is our driveway. Where is it? It's right here. We can wash the car, take a selfie on the hood. Where is my girl? I need her to get in here too. I was looking for Annette. Look at him taking a selfie. And she's already at the Bliss Bay Beach Volleyball Court. I have autonomy turned on for her. So if I wanted to turn off, I would just hit this, but she can she can do whatever she wants right now. I'm gonna let her because we'll meet her there. Get in the driver's seat. You can choose where you wanna sit. So if I wanna sit behind the driver's seat, I could do that and let someone else drive, but we're gonna get in our car right now. This is our car. We have a car. All right, cool. I'm driving it right now. Isn't that neat? <laughs> <laughs> driving watch out for me oh my gosh oh my gosh okay hold on oh 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 no i think i just hit that car i don't want to drive i don't want to drive the car actually turn on the lights open the window Ooh, i can roll down the window all right wait i have to take a picture of us driving in our car using photo mode isn't this so cool so i can change his expression could smile laugh i should look depressed i think i hit someone or surprised look storytelling i look surprised oops just got a brand new car and i think i hit someone we can also change the poses but he's inside the car so i'm not gonna do that just yet trust me i take a lot of pictures when i'm playing enzoi so you will see me get my poses and everything right okay let's go back okay I'm sorry, you're taking too long to go. Oh, oh my goodness. I don't feel like driving the whole way because <laughs> I'm nervous. I feel like it's gonna take forever. There it is. All right, can I drive here? Oh, I can't hit drive here. Okay, wait, I think I have to get out of my car. Get out of the car first. Car interaction. Oh, I could park the car. But when you park your car, the vehicle is parked on your residence lot. And so I'm standing in the middle of the street. Don't mind me. I'm having fun. I can't drive there. Can I drive somewhere else? Oh, you know what? It makes so much sense. I can't drive because hello, it's on the beach. <laughs> Duh. Okay, how about I drive over here and then I'll get close to the beach. I just want it to be realistic, you know? So it's really cool because you can bring your car anywhere. Traveling by car, auto drive is a feature in development and takes a long time to travel. Manual driving is not possible during auto drive. Pressing skip will quickly take you to the destination. So this is a feature in development. And as you can see, like the car is moving on its own. I'm not moving it actually. It's moving on its own. But I think it's pretty nice because we can choose to skip. I think it's working perfectly fine. And it'll give you a great view around the world and how good it looks. But we're gonna skip. <laughs> I'm checking in on my girl Annette and she is already here at the beach and we have some food stands and everything we're gonna check out. And here goes the cool volleyball nets. Did you buy a panini? All right, well, let's greet. Greet with overwhelming emotion because I'm feeling so joyful. <laughs> All right, let's eat a panini. Yeah, I'm just waiting for my friend or my roommate. Don't know where he is. He probably got lost. Mm, the food in Enzoi also looks so good, which y'all know is important to me. She's chowing down on this, though. Okay, we finally made it. Let me check out his preferences. I want to know if he does enjoy fitness things and stuff like that. So he doesn't like singing and he does not like reading self-help books. He loves cooking. He loves cleaning. I want to say, you know what? Maybe he doesn't like sports. We could totally make this a dislike. You know what? Let's go to Annette and change her preferences. I love how quick we can do this. It's amazing. 
And I want her to actually like ball sports. I think she's going to love, oops, love vegetarian dishes and street food. She loves painting and she loves all instruments. I want to talk about ambitions. Louise has the family happiness ambition. Ambitions are the long-term passions for reaching a goal. So right now he has loving family in progress where he wants to form a family and have a positive family relationship conversation with their partner three times. And then there are three tiers to this ambition. There's also joy of parenting, but I just chose the loving family instead. Annette has the stay healthy ambition, and there are actually three different ambitions for this one, which I'm not sure what I want to do. Creative expression. This would probably be the best because she loves to paint, and I think I would love to see that happening. An emotional reward is given when an ambition is achieved. So your Zoys are quite complex. They have different things that they can do. Her I mean, right now she values accomplishment out of everything, which is pretty cool. And I need to have them interact with each other so we can see what this means. But for right now, I really need to dress for the beach. So you cannot select preset outfits for different occasions. So for right now, I'm just going to have her switch her outfit. Let's take her shoes off. I actually like this the way that it is. But the cool thing is I could change the texture. I have some textures I added here, but it's horrible because I, I just kind of Googled some random textures. <laughs> Let's leave her in this. I kind of like this. And then we will take off her glasses. Yeah, that's cute. Now you're ready. Now you're ready, girl, because you were out here paddling and everything. Practice paddling. <laughs> and I should probably change his outfit too. What if he's shy and he's like, uh, I don't really wanna, wait, where's he sitting? Confess that you still feel awkward, suggest becoming confidants. Sure, we can definitely be each other's confidants. We are very cool with each other. We're more friends than anything, which is kind of cool. We're heading towards confidant, cherished bond. You understand and respect each other, sharing moments of joy and mutual support, a true friendship. I love that, real friends. So now our values have changed to love. The highest priority value has been changed to love. When love becomes the most important value, there is a desire to preserve and enhance the well-being of Zoe's who are close. Building relationships through, oh, okay. Wait, oh, they both value, oh, he values love now. He's prioritizing the well-being and happiness of those who are close and seeks to respond to their needs. I love that. Okay, now he's really valuing love now just from changing this. That was a pleasant conversation. Oh, you're so cute, Louise. Okay, now that makes me want to change their desires. Desires are the feeling of wanting something to happen. So right now, he desires to play a traditional card game, have a conversation about role-abiding values, <laughs> and donate clothes to Charity Bazaar. The desires will appear over their heads too, and you can hide them. I don't feel like playing a card game right now. Study tarot interpretation. That is so cute. <laughs> have a positive conversation. And then let's pin that. Have a positive conversation. Friendship power up. High five. That's so cute. Okay, but we're getting too friendly. We also need to flirt a little bit and do some more romantic interactions. This is split into love, business, friendship, and karma. The karma interactions are going to give us good or bad karma, depending on what we choose, which is great. I can actually give a surprise gift. I think that'll be good karma because we're giving. I just wanted to give you this gift. I know how much you love surfing and volleyball. I have given some feedback as far as interactions because the interactions confused me a little bit um, when I first started playing. For instance, um, actually I'm not getting the interactions that I used to have. <laughs> when you first meet a random Zoe, I swear they're the most random interactions like you can tell a Zoe that you saw a cat in front of your house and it's just so random and I felt myself just clicking on things but now now the interactions are getting kind of cool so I'm going to like for instance here we have it it says worry about caffeine addiction and this is in the love category I didn't understand it but it is meant to be very random because sometimes when you're just having a love a conversation even with your future love or someone you want to be romantically involved with it's not always romantic however i'm so used to them being heavily categorized in any simulation game that i play that this really threw me off guard like talk about fashion you saw in a magazine why is that labeled as love these interactions are still in development and i was reassured that they are still developing the interactions in the way that 
the system works. Let's go ahead and surf. We can't swim in this water yet, but I'm gonna be so excited when we can because it looks so relaxing. Ooh, let's set a fire, have a little bonfire here. Look at this, we're surfing. Go, Annette. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. That is beautiful. Oh, and that sound you hear is because I'm switching between the characters. I'm sorry if that's a bit annoying. I'm so sorry. So let's roast some marshmallows. No, you roast marshmallows too. What is she doing? Oh, she wants to go to the volleyball court. I want you guys to do something together though. Is that too much to ask? This is the volleyball court. I don't see anything that can be done here. Oh, here's the beach ball. So we can practice heading or dribbling. Let's practice heading. She loves ball sports, so I'll have her do this. And meanwhile, I will say the music when you switch, <laughs> Zoe's may get a little overwhelming. I think that might get a little overwhelming um, considering what if you have eight other people in your family. But because I'm new to this, I'm loving the sounds. I will admit, because I'm new to it, I'm like, ooh, I'm switching a Zoe. I love it. Let me pause this really quick. I love this. This is so cute. You handsome hunk. I'm enjoying their life, their simple life. Did I change his pose? <laughs> I feel like time moves slower in Enzoi and I kind of like it. I don't know why. It just feels like I'm doing more or that I have more to do. But look at all the people she met. We just really have to get out of the crush stage so we can be lovers because right now we're great friends, great roommates, great friends. We're doing great, but you know, I need a little bit more. Oh my God, the beach is so nice. I can't wait to come back. <laughs> I already can't wait to come back to the beach. Hello, did you just leave? Y'all, he left. What's wrong, Louise? Why are you so angry? He's displeased, feeling the urge. Oh, because you have to use the bathroom. I'm sorry. Well, Louise, your autonomy is turned on. You can totally go ahead and use the bathroom, love. But I wanted him to wash his car. I want him to be that person. Like, let me go ahead and wash my car. Why is she displeased? Oh, the bathroom. And she's also just feeling sad because she's artistic. See, I told you, I knew it. I don't want her to feel so sad. I don't know, that's just me though. Our house is also getting a bit dirty, so we will have to clean it. And you are supposed to clean your house because if you go to Edit City, you can even see whose house is clean and not clean and how dirty everyone is. <laughs> Isn't that embarrassing? But I love it because you can go to different households and you can see exactly how they live almost and like their personalities. Dad here is a go-getter and mom is a mediator. Baby Annie has the collaborator trait. Isn't that adorable? Like you're gonna grow up a great person, a great Zoe. And then we have the Williams household, which is so interesting. You can see how they live also and they, and they already have skills. Isn't that great? I love my little city. <laughs> I love my little city. I really do. Luis is tired, but I have him cleaning his car. He's like, yep, just got this today. <laughs> he's so cute. I know he's tired. I know he's tired, but listen, this car, we just got it today. Yep. Beautiful. And you know what? While you're at it, do you feel like cleaning this up too? We're going to clean this. Thank you. He's feeling focused. He should feel focused while he's cleaning. What's wrong, Annette? Oh, Annette has the steak that she made. Annette, why did you put it there? Thank you, Annette, for cooking the steak and bringing it in the table in your room. We have a busy schedule tomorrow because we have to volunteer, but I also think that Luis works tomorrow, which is probably gonna get in the way. Luis works at the Four Seas Surf Shop as a cashier. Now, he only makes 500 mu a day, the currency is called Mew or Meow Mew. He works from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m., which is a little intense Sunday through Sunday. I mean, Saturday through Sunday. It's in development and they are working towards having a more realistic schedule. But however, with our schedule tomorrow, we do have to go to this event. So that's at eight. So we'll at least have an hour here. And if I can skip work, then I will absolutely do that because this is more important. This is what I have to do. So I probably won't take up too much of your time. I think this is a great first part because we did so much. I think he wants to go and buy, and buy Annette a gift. It's kind of cute seeing their love bloom at the same time. I'm kind of glad that I didn't already have it set because we're such good friends. Can we do a little, we're feeling gleeful, be happy. Feeling like everything will go well. Yes, I'm feeling like everything's going well. You are my BFF. 
Let's line up all the good interaction. Look at her. Um, hold hands and talk. Ooh. Ooh, hold hands and talk. Okay. This is the cutest. I love this. She's still in her. Oh. She's like, what are you, what are you doing with my hand? He's like, no, I just, your nails are so, your nails are so cute. <laughs> so cute. I love them. Okay, okay. Wait a minute. And let's not put it all on Luis. Okay, I know he's been. He's, he's been doing a lot. We're going to confess our love. Let's confess our love. Aww. You know, Louise. <laughs> I don't really like people. I don't like others always, but you? I'm so glad that we live together. And I'm going to pledge internal friendship. Oh, wait. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Let's do, let's dance excitedly. And, oh, ooh, dazzled, d -d -d dazzled, because we held hands. Oh, and we became sweethearts. He's my sweetheart now. He's so close to becoming my true love. Let's end it with a bang. Right now, we are sweethearts. This must be love. You deeply understand each other's feelings and support one another. You share your moments of happiness and fulfillment. Should we just be together as true loves? We're already headed there. Talk about what disappointed you now. So we can decrease our romance or we can increase. And I think we're going to be together as true loves. And then we're going to get married on the next part and volunteer and do all of that fun stuff. Oh, that is so cute. Okay, I think this is great for a first part. <laughs> this is so cute. Okay, maybe we should go to bed. Yeah, yeah, we totally should. That was awkward. We fell in love in the kitchen. This is exciting. We are true loves. A match made in heaven. You share a deep bond that's hard to put into words. Your hearts are closely connected and every moment together is special. So that's us. Here we are. So I hope you all enjoyed this first part of Enzoi. And let me know what you're thinking so far. I cannot wait to play another episode of this. Look at her sleeping. Yes, get your get your beauty rest, Annette. We're also gonna do some gardening tomorrow because I have some plants out here, some bell pepper and tomatoes. And we're gonna work on our ambitions and volunteer and see where our love takes us. But I hope you all enjoyed this. If you did, don't forget to, is she snoring? That's definitely Louise snoring. That's definitely Louise. <laughs> That's definitely Louise. But I hope you all enjoyed this. If you did, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Just keep simming. Always, always, always stay baby. And I will see you in the next video. Peace out.